Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Shiro Plays. Uh, so this time we're going to be playing something a little different. We're going to be playing uh, Watch Dogs 2. Uh, so Watch Dogs 2 is an older game, I think released back in 2016. Um, I just quickly started a new game just to double check on volume and stuff, but uh, didn't really make any progression. We're going to start here. Uh, so yeah, Watch Dogs 2 is uh, you know a sequel to Watch Dogs 1. Um, very old game. I think I played that back in... Maybe like 2012, 2011. Um, essentially, it's it's it takes place in. Um, I can't remember too much of the story to be honest. Uh, I think uh, there was a company developing some sort of smart city software where, like, basically everything, all the technology within the city was connected to this central operating system, um, and you know it it was about kind of like hackers. Uh, taking control of the system for for their own gain, but also kind of to like fight back against the system. Uh, so yeah, like you know, Legion I think is the next installment of Watch Dogs. That's basically the third one, um, and I think that's coming out in October of this year. Um, so I, I, you know, I was like maybe we should play Watch Dogs too, just just to like freshen up our memory on stuff, and uh, yeah. So there's there's music in this game that is copyrighted. I ended up disabling the music, um, so it might sound weird. There might be a lot of dead air, but yeah, I didn't want to get like copyright strikes or anything. Consider this your dead sec initiation retro. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to bypass Bloom security doors and get inside. Then find and erase your personal CTOS profile. Whatever they have on me, it's all bullshit. And I'm sick of getting harassed for it. All the more reason for a purge. We'll be watching. Try to All keep right. up. So we're playing as uh, this guy, codename Retro. Um, and if I remember correctly, DeadSec is basically like... Um, I guess Anonymous would be the closest real-life... Uh, hacker group that's notorious. Like, DeadSec is basically like a hacker group um, that's fighting back against... The software called City OS. Uh, okay, so I clearly don't know what I'm doing. Press C to change cover. Cool. Okay, so we're gonna sneak up on this uh, on this guard over here, and there's a camera. Uh, so what can we do with this camera? Can I hack it? Yeah. So we can hack, and it's really like the interesting thing. I think a lot of it is like uh, you get like a lot of this um, backstory on people that you can see, which is pretty funny. I'm holy crap! This guy makes a hundred and thirteen thousand doing a security guard job. Ninety-eight k. Okay, well, these guys are all uh, making loads of money. Okay, cool. I don't know, if, like, is that just like a normal security guard, or you had to have like uh, firearms training stuff like that? Who knows. All right, so what are we gonna do? We're gonna we're probably gonna go up here and melee this guy. Uh, okay. All right, sleep time. All right, cool. And we got like a weird bola thing. Um, press Q to open inventory. We have a stun gun. What do we have? Whoa, what? I thought we got some other thing here. Okay. We're gonna use our stun gun. I don't know what the range on this thing is, but uh, we'll take a look. Uh, we'll figure out, figure that out real quick here. That's a uh, super long range stun gun. How do I get down there? Uh, I don't really. I don't want to die. Get. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Wasn't trying for that, but this guy's napping on his job. Ooh, okay. Do you not see your friend? Oh, okay. You do see your friend taking a nap. Okay. No. 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 Oh shit! Cut him. Guys. Oh my god! I freaking hate this thing. All right, go to sleep. That was unfortunate. Hit the hit the van there. Uh, all right, cool. 
Let's keep going. Um, this door is locked. Where are we going now? Uh, so yeah, I, I don't know how this is going to work out. Uh, I kind of haven't been able to win in uh, Monster Train in a while. So I wanted to try something new. Smite. Uh, didn't really like it all that much. It was very... It was different, for sure. Um, I think maybe I just kind of grew out of the MOBA phase. I don't know if you guys enjoyed that series, but uh, like I can, you know, I'll jump back into it maybe with uh, with Nisto if in the future. Okay, let's see. Full profile objects. What are you talking about? Uh, okay, cool. So it gives you hints. There's like a thing up there that I need to get to. Alright, here we go. Is there a hacking mini game? Or. Okay, I guess not. Alright, cool. Instantly done. And wow, that's a very interesting way of getting off the roof. Sir? Sir? I would like to get in, please. Um, oh. Tap instead of hold. You're wasting your time. He's not in. We're almost there. Give us a second. You. There we go. Gotcha. So that's him. He's got a gun. Is that a problem? Well, problems are why you keep me around, right? Time him. I'm curious. Too late. He's in. Already? Don't play out on them. Alright. I have no idea. Nuh uh. No synonyms either. Give me a real answer. I'm just not that into aliens or video games. It's not just any alien. It's. Oh, come on. Anyone else having a problem with their phone? Oh, what? Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah! 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 Alright. I, I don't know. Getting paid 100k. And just getting stuck up on by like a, a oh, random hacker dude it's with like retro. Uh, I forget what those are called. Hacker? I think those are called monkey that paws. Retro? Yes, we told you that already. Yeah, I never listen. Yeah, monkey paws, freaking modern rogue. Um, usually those things are just like paracord, uh, elastic or paracord bands or cords, and then on one end is just like a lead bearing. Um, probably like one or two pound lead bearing ball, and then you just whip it back and forth and just smack people in the head with it. Uh, okay, cool. So we have a stun gun. Um, I think that's like the amount of charges on the bottom there. I don't know if there's any unlockables in this game. Um, definitely not too great at remembering to, to find all the things. Okay, so I have to find a key. Okay. Cameras. Okay, I can hack this. How do I net hack? Oh, I can. Oh, I see. Do I. Oh, I, I see, I see. So I can jump around like. God, okay. So I, can, I can jump around between cameras, uh, anything in the system. Yeah, you guys are getting. I don't know why you're red. Did I kill you by accident? Okay, no, he's an illegal. Uh, performs Tai Chi in the park like an Asian grandma. Okay. Uh, okay, here we go. So. Alright, can I get through this door now? Alright. Can't remember what we were talking about. Oh! Yeah, like so like the cameras you can jump around between um all the cameras and I guess anything connected to this network. Um I guess it's what happens when you have everything So what's his deal? He was like all your technology Oakland, tied into in. <laughs> this, like his one deal center is, he's central been hanging around the dead sec IRC thing. and he's got cred. Um, Figured we'd give okay. him a test drive. Where is this guy? On the hardest difficulty. Nobody's been able to delete their CTOS profile before. I want to see if he's smart, stubborn, or both. 
There was a guy here somewhere. Or maybe it was the cameras? Yeah, I'm not sure. I would like to not have to go in stun gun blazing if possible. Okay, here we go. What is it? Mr. Sandman. Okay, so he's a... What are you talking about? You don't see him. Where are you? I... Oh, 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 here you are. Okay, so I think there's still someone up top. Can I see pe Oh, I can. That seems like you're cheating, so maybe I'll... I'll keep that to a minimum. Maybe not. Oh, crap. Oh, oh, oh. Damn it. Peek me. Peek me. These stun guns are... I don't think they're... Okay. I would like to have a normal gun. If possible. Oh my god. Okay. I can't seem to pick up their guns, which is unfortunate. Uh, looks like um, it's basically like a Grand Theft Auto wanted bar. Uh, so I guess as long once I stay hidden, uh, stay hidden long enough, the the escaping uh, thing goes down, and they stop chasing. I get a feeling at some point, like your performance, maybe your rewards per mission is going to be determined by whether or not you get uh, spotted. I don't know if this is like a hitman type system. Uh, okay, cool. Let's continue. We're gonna go and delete our CTOS profile here. He's done this before. CTOS tagged him as the prime suspect in a high-tech burglary, so... He's done time? Community service. Not enough evidence. Just the word of CTOS's predictive algorithms. Uh, once in the system? Always in the system. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh god, they do wake up. Holy shit, he went for it. You won't have much time before the backups kick in. Oh, no, 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 it's not connected? Okay, it's connected. Oh my god! Sir? Okay. All right, so, oh my god. Cool. All right, getting into like a tight space. He's going in the hot aisle. It's at least 120 degrees in there. Celsius or Fahrenheit or Kelvin. Give the man props. He's going the mile. What brand laptop is that? Is that a Razer? Alright. Are we done? Alright, that was easy. Nobody's gotten that far. This is like the secret cow level. Diablo? Uh, okay, so access the database. I think. Okay, my man just hop down from here. Alright, cool. Jump in here. Anyone in here? Nope. Let's go. Really bad security. Oh no. Complete the network bypass. Uh, okay. How do I. What is this network bypass thing? Oh, is that it? Do I have to walk around and find all of these or what? 
Oh, oh. Okay, it's like one of those like weird pipe puzzle things. Okay, cool. All right. First hack. Oh man, what code is this? What the fuck? Why is my threat so high? Whoa, this guy and his uh and his searches. This is bullshit. I don't know. Do you think like real life is like this? Fuck. Do you think the government has this much information on us? I mean probably some or some I companies just... probably have this kind of information on us. I'm I'm assuming Google. Uh, all the big tech companies. Wasn't Google building like a a smart city in I think like Toronto, Canada? I think I think they s decided to stop that. Not not sure if that was due to like public outrage or like just COVID. But uh, yeah, topical. Just gonna drop a little backdoor into the system so I can get back inside later. Sorry, Bloom. We've got unfinished business. He's heading out. Bag him. Yeah. Wait, are they on site? Wow, these guys are on site. We got an intruder. Lock down the exit and send someone to check him out. I guess I should have not shot those guys. I wonder if it would have made a difference. Like if I uh if I didn't um stun those guys, if this would be different. Like if if the um if the guards would be looking for me now. So okay, hacking. Uh, middle mouse button, trigger other functions. We can shut down with C and track with R. Okay, cool. There's something over there. Okay. I guess we can just. Oh, okay. Man out, find him. Then I thought he was just gonna be distracted. I didn't think he was gonna get shocked. Okay. I'm guessing we're going downstairs. No location on the suspect. Moving on. I think it does. That's clear. Moving on. All right. We keep going. Oh my God! How many flights of stairs? Oh my God! How many flights? Can I just jump down, please? the door. All right. Anyone? Anyone looking for me? Can I just keep running? I think we're good. All right. Easy. Oh. Hold it right there. Oh shoot. Help him. Where the fuck am I go? Josh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> well then. Fuck you, Bloom. Wait. He. How did he? Uh, he hopped down a vent and he In came up on the roof. In 2013, Chicago realized the promise of smart cities with CTOS, a citywide operating system merging big data with surveillance, security, and transit programs. With a few hundred lines of code, hackers were able to hijack its central servers and cripple the entire grid. Many believed the attack would be a killing blow for smart city development. They were wrong. Coordinated from the heart of Silicon Valley, CTOS oh, 2.0 has been SB implemented across bitches. the United States, ushering in the Internet of Things. 6.4 billion connected devices now serve as collection points, mapping and recording our daily routines, making a more secure and more invasive system. But who else is listening? Big Brother no longer works alone. Thousands of little brothers monitor and aggregate your every move, building a complete digital profile of you to be bought, sold, or stolen in an instant. 
toys, study your children, reporting their play habits back to marketers. Appliances, consoles, and home security systems give corporations a window into your private life. Control of your vehicle and mobile device can now be breached remotely by anyone at any time. You may think that you are immune or underestimate the risk, but your digital shadow is already compromised. Insurance companies use algorithms to monitor your life habits and limit or deny coverage. Health providers determine if your cancer is worth treating. Search results and news feeds are skewed to bias mood and influence your vote, engineering social uprisings on a massive scale. You are now less valuable than the data you produce. Data you produce. This is the new reality. Going dark is no longer an option. I feel like I'm watching With like a, a to personal vice. freedom rising, many are stepping forward. Like Whistleblowers, activists, YouTube and hackers video. have drawn their battle lines, putting the establishment on watch. But are they threats themselves, or have they become freedom's last line of defense? Freedom's last line of defense. All right, cool. Horrific something of doom. So? Am I in? Welcome to Dead Sec. <sighs> I'm Satara. This sweetheart is Josh, aka Hot Sauce. Hot Sauce. Yo, you're Hot Sauce? Yeah, man, I loved your frat house hat. Real talk. Thanks. This weirdo's wrench. The needs of the many. And this Casanova is Horatio. What's up, brother? What's up, man? It's the crew, huh? Took y'all long enough to come get me. Shit. You saw Bloom's bullshit. CTOS isn't just regulating infrastructure. The amount of personal data that thing is collecting is fucking mind-blowing. Yeah. It's big brother and little brother all rolled up into one. Huh? Sees everything you do and tells on you. Thank you, Josh. So what's the fix? Sledgehammers and fire. No! Sledgehammers on fire. Oh, sorry. <laughs> all of that data in one place means they can reject your fucking application before you click on it. Congratulations, you have been free rejected for our credit card. <laughs> or your house, or your insurance. That's not even the worst case scenario. All that data in the hands of the government, they'll arrest you for shit before you even do it. Yeah, I've been there. Now I fucking know why. Man, f fuck it! Man, it's a little fuck topical. It, man. Probably less so when it when this we, we first game think, this game there. first came out, but like I, I just like with current events and stuff, all. yeah. And show everyone what what Bloom's up to, man. Show show the world that their personal data is being used to rob them of their fucking freedoms. Fuck. I installed a back door, so all we gotta do is walk right through. Hold on. You what? He installed the back door, so all we have to do is walk through. Bingo. <laughs> Thanks. All right. So. Hey, man. Do you have the time? Yeah, oh, yeah, man. I got it. I got it. Man, how drunk is this guy? It's kind of late for a night run, isn't it? Hey, yeah, what, what are you running from the cops? <laughs> Maybe I am one. Hey, hey you, you look familiar. <laughs> Have a good party. I feel like this guy just got like reverse hacked or something. Fucking king this mother... Fuck you, Bloom. I'm gonna go have a goddamn good time. Oh, all right. Well, peace. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, like this hits on a, like a pretty interesting topic about like just 
you know, big corporations, government having a lot of access to your data. Um, Hello? Whose phone is this? It's your new phone. Where is my phone? In the ocean, where <laughs> yeah, you threw, threw it. it. <laughs> I think. I don't remember. I was pretty smashed. Look, meet us at the hackerspace. Where? Check your pics and figure it out. Oh no, don't make me like pattern match. I don't have a regular expression for, for like places. Okay. Actually, I think that's called just looking at a map. Um. <clears throat> All right. Oh, whose place am I in? Cause he had a good time. All right, cool. So, more cutscenes? Watch Dogs 2, roll credits. You know, like, decent looking game for, for something that's, you know, released a couple of years ago. Um, but yeah, I mean, where was I going? I think I was talking about, like, uh, you know, it being an interesting topic. Are you gonna be on a phone? Okay, no. I guess I was lit, huh? <laughs> like phone. Mardi Gras. Go get yourself something to wear, and I'll tell you where to go next. Oh, and you'll need your phone ready for operations. So hit the store and download your apps before you get here. Damn, walk of shame on my first day. Okay, let's not step into that. Yeah, so what was I doing? Uh, yeah, I was talking about uh, like being a topical, interesting topic of um, just like. A lot of companies having a lot of access to your data, uh, government as well. Uh, I mean, I've I've had this conversation with a lot of different people, uh, friends, coworkers, uh, working in tech especially. Um, you kind of get some interesting responses. I think it's kind of like a lot of people I talk to are like, um, it's kind of Pandora's box, right? It's like shits out of the bag. There's there's no way you can get this back in. Um, and there's just a lot of, I guess, in, I don't want to say indifference, but it's kind of like the problem's so big, what are you really going to do about it? Um, so, I don't know, what do you guys feel about it? Um, uh, okay, let's see where. In for apps. App stop? App shop? There's Uber. Uh, wait, where's my... Oh here, maps. Powered by Mapbox. It okay. noodle maps. Okay. Uh get information. And we can buy new pants at a clothing store. Okay, so I'm I guess I'm looking for a clothing store. Where am I? Okay, I have to go here. I can fast travel, but I would like to know where I am. Oh, uh, whatever. Let's just fast travel. Uh, take me to the clothing shop. There was a like an like a funny um, live action video about like uh, I think like Skyrim or or just like games that offer um, fast travel, and it's like when you talk to an NPC and you ask for fast travel, basically they knock you out and they drag you there. <laughs> You totally scared me. Especially this guy. When I walked in, he looked like a ghost. Uh, okay, cool. So, do we even have money? What? Sorry, I didn't mean What's to pull that? that. My bad. Okay, let's buy some pants here. How much money do we have? We have $8,000. Um, I don't know. Give me some like normal leather pants. I might as well buy... Here, I'm gonna buy some tops too, please. Oh, this looks this looks pretty good. Wait, did I Okay. Return. Is that like a freaking World War II the helmet? Okay, that's just that's just stupid, I'm sorry. No. Uh, footwear. I'm 
interesting boots. Uh, yeah, I'll take some leathers. Cool. Um, give me a man purse. Then I'll take sunglasses. I think I already have sunglasses. Not sure. Who knows? Might as well. All right, cool. Yeah. Gain followers because right, of. Alright, Sitar. So where you at? Sending you the location and the passcode for the door. So Alright, cool. So. She's great. It's back there. Uh, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna hold off. The video is getting a little long. This is gonna be it for the first part. So 30 minutes. Uh, I'll probably keep them around this, this length. Um, going forward. Um, but yeah, if you guys enjoy the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully we'll get like a couple of missions done in the next one, um, dive a little deeper into the story. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.